Hey folks, this is a kind of a bonus, uh, bonus edition of the Wal- of the Walgreens reveal, um, because I, I want to provide an update from yesterday's Walgreens reveal. Wait, uh, th- those were the chills, worlds within worlds. From uh, I've been listening to uh, lately. I, I I switch around my internet radio. Uh, choices and lately i've been listening to bagel radio and i highly recommend it um and uh but uh uh, there is going to be a walgreens i haven't been to wall one thing i've noticed is if i do these videos for you know first thing in the morning which it is to me right now at 9 30 that's first thing for me today uh, i'm gonna always look like hell like that's why it's better for me to usually it's after a Walgreens run, which occurs later in the day. But the update is that um, uh, I uh, I actually had a oh by the way this is the Bob Dylan his birthday was yesterday. I got this from John Farber, college friend, and yes I know there's someone else out there who recently sent me a. Dylan shirt that uh uh but this is uh, this is I this is my new uh t-shirt that I sleep in cuz my I finally I had a Minnesota Wild t-shirt that I slept in for a long time and it was getting all torn up into pieces because you know they get old and I finally had to send that one out to pasture. I think my brother might have sent me that shirt. I'm not totally sure though. Anyway, um so you know I always do the t-shirt of the day thing there. So, and look, there, those are like cross beams with recessed lighting in my bedroom. That's pretty cool. But anyway, um, uh, what was I saying? Oh, I actually had a, because, uh, you know, yesterday I was concerned. as like I had these, like, I just fucking look like hell, man. And, and I, uh. And, uh, and I still do today, this morning, because I haven't got myself together quite yet. I haven't put my face on yet. Actually, my face is on. Uh, but, uh, no, so I had this uh, telehealth. I had this doctor's appointment appointment uh, yesterday. Hey, that looks pretty cool to me. Does it look cool to you? Um, yesterday. And, by the way, I'm doing this telehealth appointment. And the doctor's like in his little doctor's room. And twice, another patient came in behind behind him. I could see on the video, like being welcomed in by the nurse and sitting down on the the big, the doctor's, uh, it's not a couch, but you know that doctor's thing that we all sit and lay on uh, with the, like the, um, the paper, <laughs> the paper on the cushion. I was like, this is a total, I don't know if it's a HIPAA violation, but it's some sort of violation because I don't even care that they can see or hear me. They didn't even seem to be paying attention. I can see you. I can see these, they were women in there. It's just, I mean, at University of Illinois in, in Chicago is my current, <laughs> fucked up health provider right now anyway and yeah and and, and so and it, it it's like i guess my doctor right now because i i don't this is a long story about my doctor situation there but i guess it's just it's a resident or something who then has to go talk to his attending you know so uh it's very much like chicago med I'll talk to you more about that show later, some other day. Ridiculously stupid, as you would expect. But anyway, uh, all kinds of tangents here, because I just I just woke up. But anyway, so I talked to my doctor about various issues. I had made an appointment and had various issues to, to talk to him about. And I said, you know, also, like, I don't know if you could see, but all of a sudden, I had had these, like, sharp lines here with this dry skin and and this kind of red, what's going on here? Red in the mustache area, a little flakiness here, a new little red line appears here. What the, what the? 
have I been like irradiated here? Do, am I using the microwave too much? Uh, what's what's going on? And uh, so, you know, he asked me what. Well, I said, you know, I'm using like dry, like a dry skin lotion, and he was like, well, like what are you using? And I, and I was like, well, you know, <laughs> just the. The stuff from Walgreens, Walgreens in reverse, the backwards Walgreens stuff, which is either the worst thing you can use or it's the exact same thing as something um, expensive with the same ingredients. I haven't really researched it, but he said, well, why don't you, uh, why don't you uh, use some, uh, I want you to go to Walgreens and uh and um get some hydrocortisone well it turns out i already have walgreens in reverse hydrocortisone why do i already, and i know this looks like it's almost to the end but i have another one because it was two for one see how it's all tying together so and um, I think the Walgreens, you know, it it is interesting to me that this isn't called like Wallazone, right? Like, you know, how they usually do that, like Walprofen, Wall Drill. But anyway, um, so I already have that. And uh, so it's already making a difference, right? I mean, this is a lot better than yesterday. Plus, I got you know, better sleep. Thank you, illicit Xanax. But, um, street Xanax. Um, I actually have a prescription, uh, two new prescriptions, uh, that I'll be going to Walgreens for later today. So that reveal will probably be tomorrow. One prescription though is, uh, is delayed because they're out <laughs> they're out of the product, which is a product, as you will learn later, that is also, I can just buy over the counter. And I don't know if they're out of that version too, or why they can't just go pull it off the counter and slap a prescription label on it. But my doctor said, well, you know, you could just get this over the counter. Do you want me to write a prescription? Of course, it makes no difference. But I, if I, if it's a prescription, then my Medicaid pays for it, even though it's probably only cost 10 bucks. Um, thank you, Illinois taxpayers. Of course, I too am an Illinois taxpayer. I'm a late Illinois taxpayer, but I'm merely getting back what I put in. So I deserve that $10, believe me. Um, all right, well, that's that's my, uh, my special Walgreens follow-up. I just, if anyone was alarmed as I was, you can see the improvement already here. So I think that this stuff's going to go away. The facial stuff's going to go away and that will be resolved. And, um, I won't look like I was in a, in a fight, um, every morning. And, um, and then now I'll get the rest of myself, uh, together. All right, that's it. Uh, let's go back. Let's close with some more bagel radio. Let's see what they got going on right now. Oh, it's LCD sound system. I hope I'm not violating any copyrights there. 